deal for the potential exchange of hostages between Israel and Hamas appears to be close. The Israel War Cabinet received an update on hostage talks, and the Prime Minister says that the deal will be made public as soon as there are concrete developments. LTV's William Sharon has more. Shin Bet Chief Onen Ba returned from meeting his Egyptian counterpart in Cairo and briefed the War Cabinet on the proposed hostage deal being brokered by Qatar with U.S. and Egyptian involvement. Numerous reports indicate that the agreement will likely involve the exchange of minors grabbed among some 240 hostages taken by Hamas on October 7th and Palestinian minors held in Israel for security violations. Prime Minister Netanyahu related to the potential deal, saying it will be made public as soon as there are concrete developments. Netanyahu's comment followed remarks by U.S. President Joe Biden, intimating that the hostage deal will happen soon. Mr. President, can you address the hostages directly and give them a message of hope and resilience in these troubling times? Yes, I, times. Yes, I can. I've been talking with the people involved every single day. I believe it's going to happen, but I don't want to get into detail. What's your message for the families? Hang in there. We're coming. Pressure inside Israel is building. The families of Israelis being held hostage by Hamas kicked off a five-day march from Tel Aviv to Jerusalem to demand the government do more to secure the hostages' release. We're marching to the Prime Minister to uh, shout to him that we need them home now. We need them home now. We, we, we need him to do everything he can to bring our loved ones back home. The government's two stated goal in the war after Hamas rampage on October 7th have always been to end Hamas rule in Gaza and to return the hostages. <laughs>